how do we take all of these systems and pack them into one so that, you know, if I'm an agent, I can not only schedule showings uh, for my clients, I could also interact with my clients, but then I could also engage with my brokerage, engage with my team, so I stay connected. Awesome, we are live and I'm super excited because what we're gonna be talking about today is how agents and successful agents use technology and make technology work. Because let me tell you, technology can be really fascinating. That's also why we're just a few minutes late today. So please allow me to welcome uh, Luke Larson, and he is the CMO for Showing Late, and he's going to share with us how we can work smarter and not harder. And my name is Tara Carter. I am your lab code agent uh, moderator in the Fort Lauderdale area, as well as obviously a full-time realtor. So Luke, could you give us a little introduction? Yeah, absolutely. It's good to be with everyone here. I'm, I'm filling in for Andrew and John today. I'm excited to be here. Uh, thanks for having me. Um, I think uh, one of the things that makes our company so exciting and uh, that I love about it is working with agents and brokerages uh, like all of you. I think um, gaining a lot of insight into everyone's business uh, has opened my eyes a lot to some of the pain points and uh, happy to have a platform here to, to help out a lot with agents. So uh, we have a pretty robust platform. We uh, do a lot of things for agents. Um, and excited. I'm, I'm happy to show some of it in a little bit here, but um, yeah, I think uh, our company is aiming to streamline the process for agents and improve their technology. So what was the biggest uh, motivation in regards to obviously starting uh, the company? And like, did you, you saw, obviously there was an, a problem that needed to be solved. So what was the problem that you felt you guys felt needed to be solved? Because I know there's people on this call that can relate to that. Yeah, absolutely. I think um, a little bit of background into our, our founding here. Our founders used to be agents. Um, they used a lot of different systems in their team when they were scaling it. I think uh, their team started from two agents, ended up at 30 in a couple months. And uh, one of the things that they noticed was when you're growing your business, whether you're a single agent or you are trying to grow a team or a brokerage of your own, um, there's a lot of different technology that you can use to optimize your systems, right? Uh, but the problem with a lot of it is it's very decentralized. They're oftentimes one dimensional and they don't talk very well to each other. Uh, so it can be hard in, in your own personal business or if you are growing a team to really streamline it and have it communicate together so that you're not running around logging into so many different platforms. Uh, so when we first branched out and started creating this company, it started there. It was how do we take all of these systems and pack them into one so that, you know, if I'm an agent, I can not only schedule showings uh, for my clients, I could also interact with my clients, but then I could also engage with my brokerage, engage with my team, so I stay connected. Um, and so really that was the problem we're, we're aiming to solve here is you know, create an ecosystem for agents that's gonna help you save time, um, but also help you focus on what's important, right? Which is closing deals, building relationships with clients. So um, that's where it started. There's a lot of things that we built out in there uh, to, to accomplish this goal. So. Well, I love that. And I also know, and how long have you guys, um, or how long ago did you guys start this company? Yeah, we started uh, about three years ago. I think we've been live uh, for two years now. Uh, so we've been established. We're in quite a few different markets now. So Awesome. And so, you know, time to save time, time, like you said, time is money, right? So we want to be able to save time as much as possible. What is, what has it done to the consumer experience to be able to be included the way that you guys have built this. Absolutely, and I could tell you from a personal experience on this one, I actually used our app uh, in our home market here in Denver when I was searching for homes, but that's really a big part of the platform. Agents and their clients, right? They, there's a lot of communication that goes on whether they're searching for home or even selling the home. And a lot of solutions out there don't really talk to the client. So there's a lot of manual input in your CRMs. There's a lot of screenshots that agents get from sites like Zillow that then they go look up um, that, you know, then they end up scheduling the showings for. So the way our platform works, there's a couple apps, there's an agent app and there's a consumer app. And this allows for a one-to-one -one connection for the agents. And really what that does for the consumers is it provides them a lot more transparency in the process. I can go on the application and I can search for homes 
that is the exact same data that my agent has in the MLS, right? So it's very up to date. It's accurate data. And I could find homes I want. I could favorite properties. I could send notes to my agent. And then ultimately, I can schedule showings on homes that I want to see. So for consumers, it provides a lot of transparency and makes their home buying or selling process super easy. Um, and then I guess on the, on the agent's end, that's just going to help you out a lot. There's a lot less manual input, right? When your clients are on the app, they're favoring properties, they're requesting showings, whatever that is, it's going to automatically log for you because we tie them both together. Uh, so for agents, it's going to save you time and then also help you provide a better labor, layer of service to your clients, right? If your clients are happy, um, you know, you're ultimately going to close a lot more deals. So, well, that's definitely what we want to do. And if you guys have any questions, feel free to use the chat box so we can better uh, serve you for any clarification of what you're looking for and how that works. I, my question would be, what is kind of like the elevator pitch, I want to say, or like, the short version that if I'm sitting down with one of my sellers at an appointment, what is that elevator pitch that's, you know, a sentence or two that shows them like why they have to use this and how much is going to help them? Absolutely. If you're working with seller clients, the client application will give them insights into their listing. If they need to approve or deny appointments as well, they can do that directly from the app. It makes knowing when to get in and out of the house easy. It also helps them know certain traction that the listing is getting as well as feedback, what people are saying. Uh, this helps communication. If you know agents are leaving feedback saying, hey, the price is a little bit too high, it helps agents communicate that to their clients as well. Um, so for sellers, it's really a hub for them to manage their listing, right? They'll in their app, they'll have their listing there. If they need to approve appointments, they have a nice itinerary calendar of all the showings um, that day, things like that. So for sellers, I would definitely say that for buyers, it's um, a lot more straightforward for home buying. It's no so what secret. What I'd say that, to a buyer kind of almost verbatim, because the way that you just yeah. said of what I would say to a seller made so much sense. So what would that conversation look like to a buyer? Yeah. So for a buyer, um, it's transparency, right? It's no secret that they love convenient search. That's why they go to sites like Zillow and Realtor. So what the app does, and I would tell this to your buyers, I would say, hey, I'm going to give you an application that directly connects you to me. You'll have access to the same real-time data that I do in the MLS. So you can search for homes on your time and then let me know when you want to see homes. It'll make sure that I'm connected. I know when you want to see homes and we'll make sure we get you in there. Uh, so it's a lot less back and forth with the app. You don't have to text screenshots anymore. Just send it through there. That would simplify my life <laughs> a lot, <laughs> especially if, if anybody that's on this call, if they use the showing agent model, because I, you know, I have multiple showing agents. So how yeah. awesome would that be instead of having to, uh, you know, get it from the client and then get it to my showing agent and then book it. It just sounds like it would make the world a lot simpler in that regard. Absolutely. Yeah, so and you bring up a good point too with um, a lot of agents do have that model where they use showing assistants or other people to go show the homes for their buyers too. That's part of the ecosystem we've built. If your client requests a showing with you and it's a time that you can't show it or maybe you're on vacation or maybe you're just trying to delegate to save some of your own time, you can actually do that through the app and we'll blast it out. It's almost like an Uber or Lyft, right? We'll send it out to our showing assistants they'll know when the time is, they can pick up the ones they want. And that's an opportunity for them to even make a little bit of cash on the side as well. Um, yeah. So we built that in just knowing that was a big point, especially, you know, in a lot of Keller offices, that's a very common thing. Um, so we built in delegation too. That's part of the ecosystem. I like that. And then I know because if you're part of Lab Code Agents, you guys have a, you know, a special promo. What does it look like in regards? Like if I wanted to get started today, what does that look like? Absolutely. So there's a, a couple of markets that we're already live in. You can check this out uh, from our website. Um, we're in Florida, we're in California, we're in Denver, Texas, uh, launching in new markets all the time. If, if we're not available in a market that you're in, the easiest way to get in touch and have this available is to reach out to our sales team, uh, sales at showingly.com. They'll be happy to help uh, get it set up. We can operate as long as we have the data. For agents that were in your market, it's as simple as signing up. Just go to agent.showingly.com or download the Showingly app uh, from your app store. You can create a free account and start accessing a lot of this today. Awesome. And then what are we looking at in regards to cost? 
So our platform is, is really unique. We built it based off of the showing management infrastructure. So in the app, you can connect your listings, you can schedule appointments, and we have a freemium model. So the entire platform is free for agents to get on and start utilizing. There is a subscription tier that offers more CRM functionality to enhance that consumer uh, connection. It'll give you a lot more insights into your client's preferences, um, streamline communication in that way. Um, that is $100 a month. $50 in some markets, um, it'll be reflected in the app store. So a couple different ways you can get set up, um, but free to download, free to create your account. And again, if anybody has any questions, please feel free to use the chat box. Is there anything that you could possibly show us if you think that we should see from the app itself that you have? Sure. Yeah, I'm happy. Let me, uh, I'll share my phone screen. I think giving a visual to it all always helps. Um, I'll show you a little bit of both. I think the most unique parts that agents are taking advantage of, there's never been a showing management platform that has connected your buyers into the process, right? Usually it's been agent centric uh, where the agents are the ones setting up the appointments, a little bit of seller functionality. We're actually the first uh, showing management platform that includes your buyers. So you can see here, there's two apps. This is kind of how it's set up. We have an agent app and a consumer application. If we go into your agent application, this is what all of your accounts will look like if you sign up. You're greeted first by the map search, right? It's very familiar. This is the same search that your consumers will have access to. Um, and they will be able to search for homes that they're interested in, favorite properties, perform a lot of actions for you. But if you need to schedule showings, you just click in, you'll be able to see the listing availability. And here's where you can add your clients to it. Um, so adding your clients um, is where that communication starts to streamline for you. Every time the appointments are approved, if there's status changes, your clients are gonna automatically be uh, notified of that. And it's easy for them to keep up to date. They can get directions from the app, a lot of that stuff. So this is really the unique part about it. We, we connect a lot more stakeholders in the home buying process. And all of that information is logged here in your CRM. So you can see here, I'm connected to Craig. Uh, I can tap in and view all of his favorites. I can uh, log notes this, activity. This, this would be Craig as the agent or this is Craig as the buyer? This is the buyer. So I'm in the agent app right now. Okay. So um, this is the agent app. This is the application that agents schedule showings on, manage their listings, interact with their brokerage. Um, and this is my CRM. So this is my connected client and it's a one-to-one -one connection. So this is where it gets unique. Every time Craig on his app is performing actions, they're going to be logged here in my CRM. Um, so that, that way I know I'm always up to date on homes he's interested in. I'm up to date on showing appointments when we need to go um, get them into, into a home when we're trying to put an offer, things like that. Um, so this is on the agent app. It really helps you streamline things. Um, on his app, I'll show you real quick what that looks like um, just for agents here. It's so funny you pulled that up. I literally just flew in from Denver and I was in Birmingham. I flew in one o'clock in the morning last night. I'm like, oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, we're right here down in downtown. So where are you at in Florida? You're in Fort Lauderdale? I'm in Fort Lauderdale in between Miami and West Palm. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, this is actually available there for you too. Um, this, is a, this is a consumer app now that I have it pulled up here. And this is where we're really unique. So instead of the traditional CRM where, uh, you know, it, you're leads or your prospects, they can be in 12 other agent CRMs who are also following up for that business, right? Our CRM and our connection here is unique one-to-one. -one. So in the consumer app, you can see I'm connected with my agents. I have the same familiar home search that I'm used to as a consumer and expect. And I could actually go in here and request showings with my agent. I can leave notes for my agent and I could favor properties. So this is the consumer app. Um, a lot of agents are using this as a resource for their leads, for their prospects, providing it as extra value uh, that they can give to their clients and uh, ultimately close more deals, right? Have better client retention, better service their clients. So is there anything here that's like 
you're liking or you want to touch on or want to see a little bit more? Because I know we've talked a lot, but it's it always helps to put a visual to things, I feel like. Yeah, most definitely. I mean, so besides this screen, can you just pull, can you pull the, what the other things are on the bottom? Because I can kind of yeah. that really. Yeah, so on the, this is the consumer app. On the bottom, I have my agent tab. This is where I'm connected with my agent. I can give them testimonials. I have my menu here, which is where I come to see my calendar. If I had a listing, this would be where sellers come to manage that listing, approve appointments. Um, I also have my favorite section here, which is where I can keep track of homes that I'm interested in seeing, as well as my itinerary. So here's a couple homes that I saw here uh, in Denver. Um, it's my itinerary for the day. If I have upcoming showings, I can see the statuses of them, click in to get directions, things like that. So this is for uh, a home buyer. It makes it really easy and transparent. Um, I don't have to, you know, communicate schedules and have to figure out when I'm showing up. And then ultimately at the end of the day, when I saw 10 showings, it's easy for me to remember which ones I liked and which I just go back to my itinerary here. Um, so these are, those are the different screens inside the app. Oh, that's smart though. So then you can go back to it. Absolutely. Yeah. If, I mean, if you're seeing a lot of homes, it makes it really nice for the consumer. They say, yeah, I liked, what was that second one I saw? How many beds did it actually have? I can go in here and see that. And then obviously any upcoming. Yeah, so, exactly. The one with the three, the three, like I'm assuming that's the menu button. Does that just pull up everything else? Yeah, the menu button is kind of my hub for my schedule and if I had listings. So if I was a seller um, and working with an agent to sell the home, I'd have a little listings button here. And that's where I would go to see the um, feedback on the home, showing history, as well as approve or deny appointments if I need to. Awesome. And Jesse, you know, Jesse just commented that, you know, this is app it is an app that also works with buyers. I mean, with sellers listings, because I'm with Keller Williams as well. And we have obviously an app that, that does that, however, not at this level. So this is really the first app that's ever really put the broker with the listing or the agent with the buyer. Like it's an app for everybody, correct? Yeah. Yeah. And I would say too, because we do work with a lot of Keller Williams agents and brokerages. This well, pairs yeah, really we well. Other, we have tons of other uh, uh, non-KW agents in, in our in our lab code agents world for sure. Absolutely. Absolutely. And I think for those that are specifically in Keller Williams, Command does a really great job. And honestly, a lot of agents use this to supplement it right? The one thing that is missing um, is the showing scheduling. So that's where our app comes into play. If you do have listings, you can connect your listings, configure them how you need to um, so that you can set up appointments. So I'll show you real quick what that looks like. Um, this is on the agent app now. If you go to your listings, you'll be able to see all your listings, see pending requests, if the seller still needs to approve them, as well as tap into view showing history. So a lot of agents are using this to supplement commands and provide this to their clients because it links directly with where you schedule. So it just ends up making it easier. Got it. And we have a question from Peggy from Facebook and she said that, you know, they want this in San Diego County as an alternative to showing time. How is that coming along? Like, how do you know what areas it's coming to? How can somebody get it in their area? Absolutely. San Diego, I know, is one that we are launching fairly quickly. Um, we have a lot of relationships with MLSs already. We have a whole MLS team that's working on those. For us, it's really just a matter of having the data to operate, right? We got to have the listings uh, for the search and for you guys to connect them. So if we're not available in your market quite yet, please reach out to sales at showingly.com and we'll get in touch. We can work through data agreements with you. Obviously, member interest uh, within MLS is always, always speeds things up. So if this is something that you like and you want available in your market, please reach out to your MLS and just let them know that. That's going to ultimately help us get to a, a deal quicker. And what was that email again? Sales at showingly.com. And I could probably put it in the chat here. I just did. There you go. Awesome. Cool. Well, I think this is pretty exciting. And the best way for you guys to be able to um, see what the lab code agent special is as well and kind of learn more about it is in that link that is above that I just put in as well as you can email. I think that probably the more people like it's like tell your 10 friends agents, let's all email them and let's create kind of an urgency and demand around it because if they keep hearing about it and see it, the more people that ask for it, the sooner you'll probably get it. Right. Absolutely. Absolutely. And it's, 
usually an agreement within the MLS is where, hey, it's included in your dues. So um, let's get it available to everyone. We're excited. We're growing very, very quickly. Uh, we're happy to work with you guys. If we're not in your market, please do reach out. Uh, we'll, get, we'll get available as quick as we can. Uh, as soon as we get on this call, that's exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> my whole it. team. Um, yeah, can we, because we have um, three different markets. So I mean, that's the first thing I'm doing as soon as I hang up. You are awesome, Luke. I love what you're doing for the real estate community. You are giving value. And we as real estate, real estate agents love companies and people like you that will, that literally are looking to solve problems for us and make our job easier to be able to really live an, unlive, uh, an unreal life and, and go out there and make that money, but really how many families can we impact at once? So I just want to thank you and I appreciate you. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Tara. All right. Well, we will see you soon. And this re recording will be on uh, YouTube and probably next few days. Make sure you guys are subscribed to Lab Code Agents on YouTube because anything you ever miss, it's always recorded. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you again, Luke. And I look forward to seeing you soon and getting uh, your systems down here. Absolutely. Thank you guys so much. All right. Have a good day. We'll